He's a proper gentleman, that man. His name is Zolf. No hiding he's an Ura. Folks like him ain't never been a common sight in Ceylandia. He's relieved to see a living face or two. The kid and I introduce ourselves in kind. Both to him and to each other for the first time. I don't really see the point of stream elements um, putting a go-live announcement in my own stream chat. But it couldn't hurt, I guess. The cores. Hey, remember. That's why this place is coming together. That's why things are gonna be alright. Ceylandia was like a second home. He's real worried about his first home, too. Far to the east. He was born in the Tazzle Terminals. The Ura sent him on a mission of peace to our city, and he's lived here ever since. We fought the Ura decades ago, but that was then. Things are different between us now. Anything I can build right now. Here. Lost and found. Here, kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. Yeah, that one seems good. Feeling low, count on the buttery flavor of her own bastion bourbon. We tracked down a couple more cores near the edge of the city. Options. That's Cinderbrick Fort where the marshals used to watch over the city. There's Pith Orchard, built in honor of the bull, and folks like Zolf, who pray to him. No use praying to the gods these days. No time for it either. Kid says a little prayer anyway. Couldn't hurt, right? Wonder how long he just keeps talking if I don't do anything. <laughs> P 
Pith Orchard. Place is a dead end in more ways than one. Folks used to make pilgrimage here, to pay their respects to Pith, the bull. Well, the gods are long gone now, and the Orchard core is long gone too. Seems Pith ain't much of a watchdog. So many branching paths, man. The gods don't care about trinkets, but the kid ain't no god. Something once. Something real. In time, though, the bull stopped being a symbol and started being decoration. zoomed out real far for that. I can hardly see anything now. So what'll it be? Invoke the gods? Or tell them off? Piv. Guess I'll try it. Kid decides to press his button. Oh, jeez. Alright. Well, if the gods are alive, they must be plenty sore. Well, that was a. Uh... Kid ain't never seen one bags that quick. Maybe old Piff would have scared him. Gods ain't gonna catch you if you fall. Thanks. Sheesh.
berries. I ate them all already. I'm not supposed to deflect the shots if they don't even hit me. Shooting that turret, though. It looked like there was they another. Found the core, the least he found Zolf's precious shrine. I thought I remembered there being more branching paths to look through in this level. Maybe I missed them. We can build a shrine of our own, though I got some alternatives in mind. Zolf doesn't touch the thing. Says the god of commotion is no children's toy. Kid says hello, but Zolf's lost in thought. I forget if turning the pith. Turn forget it around if... and round all you like. Pith's still gonna be ugly. Maybe that's all it does. I was gonna say I forget if turning the uh, turning the pith in different directions actually does anything. Viura feared the gods. We turned them into toys. Put their faces on our walls. Okay, look how cute it is, though. Come on. Uh, well, since I can't build the shrine yet, I can't. Dread rooms brewed from swamp weeds, so its effect is as bold as its flavor. I keep getting upgrade materials for weapons I don't have. To. this bull head court uh. that's the bull head court folks defended themselves there with shields not words probably gonna be here for a while the accused always got a fair shake in Ceylonia some used to take the bull head trial Deflect attacks without getting hit. I guess taking hits is probably the condition for which reward you get. I mean, there's health pickups here, so. 
survive the trial without taking a scratch, you'd walk away a free man. Yeah, I don't have any of my actual weapons. Ha! <laughs> There's one already. Okay, so it only takes two carries to kill those guys. At least there's that. First, the good defense is a good offense. I wonder if I can. I kind of want to start this over already, <laughs> just because I took the one hit. I probably have to get. Do even come back? Does the reset button work yet? Yes, it does. Let's just do that. Court is back in session. I might as well just restart if I get hit so I can just get the uh old ritual from when folks believed there was this godlike bull watching over him. Had to make do with nothing but a shield. Full set of rewards in one run. Not in one run really, but you know what I mean. It's not too hard to time. Oh boy. Make some space. Oh, he reared back longer for that one. Okay. Darn it. Okay, at least it only takes one hit. There we go. Remember how long this goes on? Is that the f Whoa! Uh... Yeah. They're so inaccurate. Sheesh. Okay, jeez, that guy's... Wow! Wait. That was the counter, but I still took damage. Jeez. Alright, let's try that again. We're just gonna sit here and grind it out until I get that gold win. Until I get that gold medal. I kind of have to look at when they start vibrating. Okay. You know, this freaking guy. Okay, there we go. So if I just get in its face, I mean... That kind of works, but it takes a while. Let's just take it easy here. Oh crap, what do I do with these? These guys don't have very much of a tell for when they're about to attack. What the heck? I was shielding! Uh. Yeah, that's tough. Restart. I stood too close to it, that was foolish.
Yep. How does that happen? I'm being scammed. Let me just, uh... Okay. Alright, that's working. Well, if I screw up on the first damn enemy, then at least uh, I didn't waste very much time on it, you know? Waited too long. Perspective is a little wonky sometimes. Yeah, I gotta use the shield in general more often. Because I kind of totally forgot that you can carry non projectiles with it to deal damage. So I guess that's what this uh, little challenge is for. Teach you about that. Oh yeah, I can just get them to shoot each other as well, but they don't do very much damage. I need you to actually hit me. Ah, uh, why? Why are the weaker enemies the hardest in this freaking challenge? I haven't even gotten back to the little squishy guys. I forget what they're called. Windbags. Fighting the smaller ones almost threw me off, and I... Anyway... Starting again. Yep. 
Okay, for some reason that one got her. Oh, come on. Surprisingly snug. Yeah, oh, this freaking guy. Even between the time that he pops in and when you need to block his attack, if he gets close enough to you on his spawn, it's hard to react to. Occasionally it'll start to cross my mind that maybe I should just forget about getting the gold in this one and just accept taking a couple of hits. Uh, but no, that's foolishness. Banish the thought from my mind. See, if I could just attack, I could break their box before they even come out. But that's not the point, is it? I should put some more space between them. Alright, that'll do. Okay. What? Hit me! Oh, I think I turned around and I wasn't shielding that direction anymore. Shoot. This is going to be tougher than I thought. You gotta be careful with my positioning when they start doing that. But particularly with the uh, with the rapid fire sentry towers. When they, st when, when they start throwing more than one of them at me at a time. up a little bit. It's in the way of the UI. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. I actually did that one too early. Ah, oh, man. 
was surprisingly difficult to time. You know, when I finish this whole playthrough, I'm, I might go through the stream archives, look back and do the math on how much time I spent just on these uh, moving grounds, trying to get the, the uh, top reward for all of them. And I might not be happy when I see the result. Man. It's hard to do it on reaction, you kind of just have to get a feel for it. You know, I don't actually know for sure that that the highest reward for this one requires you to not get hit. I was kind of just assuming, but maybe I should look that up and make sure here. Uh, what the heck is this one called again? This article I'm looking at doesn't have Bullhead Court in in the list of... It mentions it, but it's... All right. Uh... Hmm. Uh, bullhead Court Rewards... Oh, first place requires you to be hit less than two times. Okay. Less than so one so so I can get hit once, basically. So I probably don't need to restart the challenge every single time I get hit once. I will, however, be restarting the challenge every single time I get hit a second time. Pretty small. Oh, look, these actually don't even start opening if, I don't, if I'm far away. Man, get hit! What the? 
That one counted, but it didn't deal damage to him. That's weird. Well, there's two. <laughs> uh... This one does just kind of take a while to get through. Whether you do well or not. Okay. Oh, I can roll through the boxes to damage them, but I doubt it's possible to... ...break it all together in the time you have. Just by rolling. Yeah. Come on. Alright, that's one. Okay. Crap. Alright, so they puff up a bit before they attack. It's kind of subtle, but. Come on. One of you. Alright, that one's not that bad. Ugh, what the hell? I turned again! I'm a doofus! Wow, that did a lot of damage, alright. It's tough though, because other stuff starts popping in. Yeah, right, let's just restart that one. I don't need to be taking hits from the first dang turret. Vexes me a little bit that one counter attack almost deals enough to deal to uh, kill one of those things in one hit, but it just has one little pip of health left, so you have to do it again. It hit the frickin' brick wall between us. Just you, me... Okay. Ooh. Okay. Gotta be ready for that guy to come out. Crap. That hit me? Aw, oh, man. Swears, the timing feels ever so slightly different each time. Jeez. Woo! Come on. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. Okay. I can. 
to separate them a little bit. Alright. Ah, oh, the wall again! Ugh. Wait, what? One of them just, like, flew across the whole stage. Boy, we are gonna be here for a while, huh? Well, at least it flew back. <laughs> I wonder if they have the same amount of health inside the box as they do outside of it. If so, you would need to hit them like 15 or 16 times with a roll while they're in the box, I think. Okay, good. Oh, crap. We'll do this the long way if we have to. There. I wish I could lure them away from each other a bit better. I don't really want to deal with them all at the same time. Okay, I should at least approach them with my shield up, so if I get attacked, at least I don't get hit. Hmm. Off to a good start. Oh, come on! Frickin' terrain? What? Ugh, shoot. I just stood too close to it and I couldn't react in time. I think I should set a cutoff point for this, because I'm spending a lot of time on it. Like, I wanted to play this whole game on the stream, but this should probably be something I do after I... I do off uh, the stream, just so I don't waste too much time on it. Alright, that's one. And that's two. Okay, I mean, I'm still in it, but no, no, I'm not. Jeez. That... I think it locked my aim onto a different one than the one that I was trying to deflect from. I don't remember exactly where I had my mouse, but I thought I had it over the one that I was aiming for. Perhaps not. Okay. 
Okay, I just missed all together. Flex damage, can I? Oh my god, stop! There we go. Alright, give me something else. Crap. Oh, okay. I'll take it. Oh no! And when to just step aside and let things go. Crap! Ah, oh, jeez. Wow, that's tough. Damn. I'm hoping this is the last... What? Ah, uh, frig. It's still... I didn't even see that it was still up, dude. It's so tiny. <sighs> you can get hit 11 times and, uh, and still get second prize? Wait, next prize is 3 hits or fewer. Okay. Maybe the information I was reading was from an earlier version of the game or something. Oh, I have my weapons now. Yeah. <laughs> I know I already said that this is going to be tougher than I thought, but it's uh, going to be tougher than that even, as it turns out. I think I will come back to this one while I'm not streaming. And we can just move on now. I think well, we spent enough time on that. Wanted to compete in the bullhead trial. Okay, so that was just a lot of money. I don't think there's anything else other than the lost and found that I can just spend a bunch of money on. Oh, that would actually make that easier. I do extra damage when parrying with the shield, so stuff that takes two hits would just die. Finders keepers. I'm not gonna. I'm still not gonna do it right now, but I'll be sure to equip that before I try that again. The two hundred it costs is probably worth the investment. <laughs> We're getting uh however much money you get for first prize. Uh, I'll not spend too much money on upgrades right now since there's still more weapons for me to try out. Oh, they're called squirts, that's right. A little tiger break.
Hear what you mean? Sure, the city marshals may be gone. But now the fort's crawling with windbags. Wham! The kid's ready for the windbags this time. Oh god. Yep. What I get for trying to use some of what I learned. What is that guy just stuck out there? Alright. Block here. Okay, I just missed the box altogether. The calamity was mercy for normal folks. The wind nice. bags ain't so lucky. Whoa, what? Ah. Uh. What? Frickin'? They've been left to freeze or starve or face the kid. Damn it. It's actually good that they give you the um, proving ground for the shield at the same time as this level unlocks because it kind of comes in handy. Where are you facing? What the hell? Uh. The wind is actually blowing the shots out of alignment. They're just hitting themselves more often than they're hitting me. Uh, maybe over here. Oh, level up. I forgot this game had this. Yeah, that's uh bags young and old keep fighting for the fort. That parry is really useful now that I've gotten the hang of it a bit better. Now that I've been forced to. Whoa! Okay. Kid can't hardly tell up from down after a while. What the hell? That's weird. Switch. Switch what? Open this cage. Hold on. At least the marshals left the kid a part and give. Ooh. Scrap musket. Uh. Something the windbags just can't handle. Something that'll punch clean through the greasy eyes. Okay, it just has a reload time after each shot. It looks like. 
I, it wouldn't surprise me if there were like a double barrel of crate for it though. The only thing I don't like about the strap musket is the noise it makes when reloading is kind of grating. It's a little too realistic. I don't know why I'm bothering to destroy all this. When the bags ain't much different from normal mm. folks. All they want's a warm place to stay and a decent meal. That's a pretty good strategy, honestly, just keeping the shield up and right clicking to fire the musket. Musket seems just pretty dang strong overall. I think I'll keep it. Oh, I guess I could have. They gave me three of the dang those. I guess I'll just pick them up as XP now. Dread rum. Business underground, like in the old days. Yeah, blocking these as well. Let me see what happens when I actually. It's not much better. Cinderbrick gave him enough heat and metal to munch on for a while. Well, the fort ain't theirs, my right. Can't blame him for wanting it, though. Whoa. Okay. Unexpected. Seems like they either sorry things hold up inside that old fort. Take reduced damage or don't take damage while they're doing their spread attack. Not a scratch on him as he presses on the higher ground. Jeez. Yeah, I like this combination. It's a little cheesy, but it's fine. I didn't get all the way over there. Freaking... 
blasting everything in sight with that new fangled uh. biscuit. Damn it. Still having a hard time landing the power shot. Kit stash of grenades is there for him if things get even worse. Thank you for the reminder, Russ. And I would be saying that sarcastically, but I actually haven't used the grenade yet. Those things have a lot of health, man. It ain't afraid to get burned. There's so much. Kid takes that, Ludus. Maybe it was Glandon. What? What? What hit me? Loads of money. Get that in a second. Kid shows up just as Zolf's telling me about his own journey to the city. 
Ooh, hookah. Seems the only thing the calamity saved for Zolf was a smoking pipe. Poor kid collapses after just one drag. Oh wait, what does this do again? The past. Only good thing ever come out of the past is history. I totally forgot about this. Okay, I've got my stuff. Well, I can leave at any time, seemingly. Oh! Okay, there's the optional combat encounters, I guess. Kid. Hardly had a moment's rest since all this started. Oh wait, stop! Get my money. Oh come on. I fell off. Say he's led a hard life. Supposing what he says in his sleep ain't no lie. Ah. He never knew his old man, but he had his mama to take care of. Frail thing with pure white hair like his. Jeez. Mama's hair to the kid no favors while he was growing up, but he learned to hold his own out there. Oh, jeez. Ah. Oh, that really made short work of those guys. I can remember that. Out, so the kid signs up for a turn on the rippling walls. Make his mama some money. Oh, jeez. Wait, the, the, the counter. Oh my god. Thanks to folks like the kid, the walls kept Zelania safe from whatever's out there. The elements. The era, you name it. What the? Why did I get? Ah, uh, damn it! Once a kid done his time, did it fall off? Hurried on home. Turns out his mama's time was done too. The city had nothing for him. 
No, I used all my grenades, damn it. And home was nowhere right. to be found either. Well, now I need to use more. So what the kid do you gotta give him back? Why he went right on back to the walls for another five years. Oh what? Jeez. Can't block everything, man. In the history of Ceylandia, nobody's ever volunteered for a second shift on the walls. What? They missed altogether. What? Oh, off. Nice. How there, kid learn to fend for himself, learn to build, learn to break. Ah, uh, come on. In time, the kid earned good standing with the marshals. They trusted him to scout out farther than anybody. Red room. One night, on one of his expeditions, the ground beneath him shuddered, cracked, and split apart. He saw nothing where the world used to be. The calamity happened just like that. All the kid had to work with there. was his hammer and the clothes on his back. Alright, bye bye. Crap. These guys suck! Please don't be dead. Through twisted streets, he ran with nothing but the city crest and an old stranger's voice to guide him. Jeez. Wait, did I get hit while I was falling off into the void? Uh, why do they have so much freaking health? Alright. Jeez. Finally arrived at Ceylandia's vaunted safe haven. He and no one else. 
Black tonics, please. Oh, my God, what? Why did they do so much damage? Jeepers. Sure, I may be the one who dreamt up the walls and the bastion, but the kid made him real, not me. Oh no, it's a... This is going to suck. Yeah. Yeah, I need to keep moving around the stage so I can't get locked in by the loop. Okay, there's Pith gone. say I'll never forget him or what he's doing what he's done I surely would <sighs> Harry Harry scary I'm looking at I'm not gonna hit that thing again just yet. Zolf's travels ain't much compared to what the kids had to go through for all this. Did the marshals ever give you a hard time being an Uda and all? The marshals seem like good men, he says. They treated him with dignity. Where'd you get this? In the city, they used to say this stuff was very strong. Zolf brought his antique smoking pipe all the way from the terminals. It has a... I guess that's when it prompts you to actually do it. Zolf's the talkative sort. At least he used to be. Even since the Ura surrendered to us, the marshals kept a wary eye on him. All right. Well, uh, yeah. Oh, is there a? I don't have a skill for the musket yet. I'll just go see if there's one I can buy. Anything survives a musket shot ought to be quick work for that blade. Oh, this is it, yeah. Final warning. Huh. I'll try it out. I mean, it seems similar in application to the grenade. Let's see how much does all this other stuff cost? Whale ale. 
Staffs. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We'll try it. It wasn't fixed. It was unbroken. Uh, okay, coarse. Something coarse is the upgrade material for the scrap musket. I think I will spend a little money on that. Pith wasn't on that whole time. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Just seeing if I'm able to keep the music playing while I'm on the BRB screen. It looks like it works. I might need to use that in a second here, let's see. I might regret this, but I'll try running with both of these and the for a moment. Never liked competing for people's affections. <laughs> Greasy. More range and less spread. Well, I have the machete throw for ranged attacks. Or more spread and less range. Scrap musket, you start with the barrel. Extra damage or knockback. Let me try that, because I'm the actually thinking. Learn to pack those shells full of fire. Well. Let me try this out. This might be. I'm thinking if I'm just using the machete for long range, I should just be using the bow instead. But, um, then I don't really have any rapid attacks. But if I can knock people back with the musket shot, then that might be useful as a get off me tool. So I'll try it out. Oh, there's no. He doesn't say anything about that one? Hold on. Damn it. I assumed there was a line for every possible combination of weapons you can use. Uh, so what's the next one of these available for the bow? Because I can just go by. Oh, I have to have one in order to even see what it is. Well, I don't want to commit just yet. I don't have another slot. Lunkhead Liqueur. Oh yeah. I don't think that's what I want to use right now, though. Squirt cider will toughen you right up. Too bad about the musty aftertaste. Alright. Be right back.
Hey. What else we got? Oh, there's a uh, proven ground for the hammer. And the musket, okay. Let me try out these first. That's a scrapyard where folks got to smash things and call it community service. The city's unwanted things all met their end in the yard. Oh, no connections. <laughs> folks have fouled up will do their time here, smashing things to bits. Quickly destroy 100 objects. The quicker they work, the sooner they can go. Oh, is that so? Folks learn to plant their feet and put their backs into it. You really need to stop moving for a sec. Third prize. Alright. Next prize, 40 So I need to hit 100 objects. And second prize is 40 seconds or less. Whoops. Meant to just restart. I probably don't really need to do this one. I'm not really planning on using just camera smash things for a while. You know where to go. Alright, I'm all the way back here. I guess I can go ahead and upgrade the hammer with the material I just got to make it a little easier. I haven't upgraded at all. Oh wait, yes I have. Just extra damage. I wonder if that counts, though. On just destructible objects. Well, neither of these seem applicable. Doesn't really say what the focus attack does, though. <laughs> and this isn't Street Fighter 4, so I'm at a loss. Kid pays another visit to the scrapyard for old time's sake. Oh shit, that's still only second prize? I came in under 30 seconds. 27 seconds, oh my god. I hit 28, dude! Okay, let's go again. where I'm actually pointing the mouse pointer.
27 seconds is uh, not a very long time, as it turns out. Close I got. I should have been paying more attention on that one attempt when I almost got it. So I'm not really sure where. What I should try doing differently, really. Sorry, that went over. That sucked. I think I just need to be more deliberate. I'm having trouble even hitting things that are right in front of me sometimes. Look at that. Come on. What do you... I did it. Almost. Thank <laughs> you. 
definitely doesn't do me any good to just miss a bunch of my swings altogether. I fell off? Really? Man. Okay, that attempt actually wasn't that bad. I think just... I think just mashing... ...is actually not such a bad strategy here. Okay, but I still don't want to fall off. Then again, I fell off like twice that uh, time before this one and uh, almost got it. <laughs> so... There's probably some leeway there. Stuff I was hitting just wasn't breaking. Okay, I'll take one fall. Damn it, man, it was so close. Too much time making sure I got everything. Keep hitting like 97. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I wasn't even looking at the time before I knew it. I was several seconds over the limit. I need to... Yeah, that sucks. I probably need to hit more than one thing with a single swing as often as possible. Probably not doing enough of that. God, break. movement. Whoops. Wait, do I maybe actually want to try that? It sounds wonky, but... I can just click on stuff. That, that actually might not be... Let's just see. This is my group here, man. What if I literally just try mashing all the buttons as fast as hard as I possibly can? I think it's going to get me the first prize. I think knowing when to use the stationary swing for bigger damage and knowing when to just roll all over the place and sweep stuff out of the way is definitely one aspect of this. Thank <laughs> you. 
Damn it. It's too hard. Yeah. I just end up missing so often. Let me try one more time, actually. This is probably another thing I'm going to end up having to finish off the screen at some time, but... Oh my god, that sucks. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm trying to do better than in previous attempts. Jeez. I said one more try, but I'm going to give it a couple more tries. I think I'm getting the hang of it. Yeah, I need to recognize the stuff that can actually just be destroyed by rolling. No, I can't roll. I can't roll before I pick up the hammer. Yeah, like a, a lot of the places where there's a bunch of smaller things bunched up, you can just roll through it all. Like these barrels and wooden crates. Of course if you... Damn it, get me out of here. I just feel like I'm so close. I need to find a good rhythm of rolling through some of the weaker stuff and then smacking some of the stronger stuff. Come on. And not missing quite so often will also help. Not having to go back for things.
What? Come on. Why can't I hit this purple thing? Oh man. I just keep missing swings. Yeah, I've got this all all screwed up. Ugh, sucks. Why am I doing worse and worse? Man. I think I'm thinking about it too much. Like, the best attempts I've had have really just been me going wild on the damn thing. Which doesn't seem like it should be the answer, but... It's volatile. It's not a very reliable strategy. I just need to be able to control myself better while I'm flipping all over the damn place. Come 
come on. Man, why does there have to be a bottomless pit at the sides? Jeez. I keep moving, man, but I keep falling off. not getting there. I can't believe how close I've already come, but no, I just can't make it happen. surprising amount of precision to this.
I'm gonna spend like another minute on this before I go on. Oh, that's not helping. to be another one of those things I'll do off the stream sometime. Uh, hang on. Oh, I still only have one. That's right, the, the second place prize was a different... something wrong. It was a different weapons upgrade material for some reason. Zolwood Grove. A nice, quiet place to show a musket a good time. <laughs> Ever felt a Zolwood gourd? Like picking up broken glass barehanded. At Zolwood Grove, marshals learn to make every shot count. Destroy all targets in few shots. The trick was to pop all those nasty gourds without wasting ammo. Those marshals didn't get far on their first few tries. Catch a bunch of those gourds in a single shot. Muskets is the best of close. Hey. <laughs> best of the best to clear the course in just a few shots. That was easy. Scrap cell. Kid probably could have made himself marshal one day. Maybe that just means it was meant to be for me to use the musket. Well, now it can already... It's 800 uh, shards to finish upgrading it though, jeez. Faster reload or reduced penalty to long range damage. I think it'll take the faster reload. I wonder if I should spend all that money right now though. Uh, I mean, I don't think I have anything else to spell it, spend it on right now. Oh. I think I picked up another special ability, Scrap Salvo. Let me just see what that is. It's also for the musket. Hmm. Well, I haven't even had a chance to try this one out yet, so I think I'll do that first. A bow ain't much good in the crowd, but a musket sure is. There it is. That's what I wanted. 
That's the Langston River. Used to cut all the way to the wild. Think it was bad then. The Langston River flowed free and wild till the calamity drank it all up. Maybe all that water just grew wings and flew off. Of course, this has an even longer charge up for the power shot. I might end up sticking with the machete, but we'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, this also has a uh, piercing view. River bank swarming with wind bags. They're so wow. bent on climbing the core, they hardly notice the kid. Lucky for him, a certain famous fairy barge is still afloat. Oh, come on! I shouldn't have picked up that health potion. We Nelly. She sends some squirts crying home as she leaves port. Maybe Nelly knows the way to the core. Maybe she can slip right past all the clamor on the coast. Or maybe not. Security skiff pulls up port side. Nelly's just another windbag to those guns. Just then, the windbags notice who she's sailing with. Man, pretty steamed about what happened at Cinderbrick. What the hell? They try to cut her off. They try to slow her down. Ah, uh, hate it. They try to knock her out. At least I can still hit them when they're up in the air like that. Nelly tries harder. Try as she might, though, she hits a snag. Kids gotta help her get untangled. Favors for favors. For a break, it's the core is right there. Where are those little grenades coming from? Screen, okay. Why? Well, kid ain't got time to think it over just yet.
he finds a weeping Nelly raring to go. Uh. Oh, these are mine. Okay. Turns out she's got a special surprise for when the waters get rough. She's gonna need a little help with all that beggars. Crafty things think they're king of the roofs now. The rest of us only wish we could fly in times like these. Oh, it's one of the. Damn it! I know what that is. I might take that one off. That was pretty annoying. was the most beautiful place in the world. We all knew that. But on the other hand, solved your button puzzle. some folks just yearn to see the things they're told they can. Oh, great. And that's why you go to Prosper Bluff, ain't it? Yeah, the kid hears something he ain't heard in a long while. How's it go again? Thank <laughs> you. 
Rangers. They just They just kinda of fly around. Hmm. Rickety. Yeah, I know. <laughs> explaining what happens next, right? Suffice it to say, kid ain't coming home empty-handed. And besides, it's like the song goes. He'd see a fellow her again. We become fast friends. Calamity has that effect on people. But there was more to be done. There was one last core to find. Whew. All right. Maybe I can save that for another time, though. Anything I do now, I'm just gonna have to do again when I load into the game, so. I'll do it for now. <laughs> 